And I'm gonna show you how to create content so that you always know what to say and you always know how to grow the business just using basic, simple videos. Now, <laughs> I've bought this thing here, which allows me to give you a little bit different perspective. And I've got a thing laid out here for you. <laughs> Silly ass thing. We're gonna break this down. I'm gonna show you these things here. I'm gonna show you what you've gotta do with the person. I'm gonna show you what to do to get people to go over and actually get your stuff, buy your stuff, become a lead, become a sale. I'm gonna lay out the exact format. I'm gonna show you what we've gotta do and where people mess up with this whole thing. And then I'm gonna show you the steps and the only options that you have. And this is gonna remove the dizzy, I don't know what I'm doing, I feel lost, I don't know how to talk to my person, I don't know how to find my person. That's gonna go away, but I get it. I know it's challenging. If you've never done this stuff before, how are you supposed to know how to do it? You know, if you've never ever created content, of course you don't know how to do it. No different than if you've never played a sport before and you're trying to figure out how to do that. So I'm just gonna give you some ideas that work for me and that allow me to make a lot of money doing this. And I just work here, this is my office. I know I've got a lot of gadgets back here. All of it is basically unnecessary. Um, I just like this stuff, <laughs> so I, I have it. And it just helps me give you different perspectives and different ways to talk to you. But I get the challenge. I understand. You know, maybe you don't, you don't care about being on video, like it doesn't bother you, that's great. That's a really good thing. We use video to do this stuff. It doesn't always have to be your face. Like right now it's my face, but I'm also gonna show you how to do it faceless with this thing. And this is my first time doing it with this thing, so bear with me. Hopefully it turns out the way I envision. My biggest takeaway for you is to know when you go to create content, how to actually do it. And I'm doing the steps that I'm gonna teach you how to do this with. I'm doing them to you right now. Please pay attention to this and it's gonna help you create content which will help you get leads and help you get sales. So let's dive into these steps here. So hang on, if you get motion sickness, just bear with me. So that's what I had this thing in, a little holder here. It actually folds up pretty cool. And then here's our content stuff. If you want to unlock and always know what to say with your content, here we go. And if you wanna turn your knowledge into income, I've got a free training over at makeones.com. Just press the red button and you can join the, the program for free. So every single person, when they look at your stuff or decide to do something, there's three things that we have to check off and make sure that we get people to understand. The first one is anything that you're sharing with them, any opportunity, anything that you're trying to sell, they have to be able to say to themselves, yeah, I can do this. I believe in this. So you have to get them to believe in their self. Until you unlock all three of these doors, they're not gonna spend any money with you. You are always in your content trying to share how somebody can actually do this. If somebody can't see themselves doing what you're sharing, they're not gonna do it. Why would they? They don't see themselves doing it. So you have to share things that show them how they can do it, how they can believe in themselves. So we've got to unlock that one. The next one is they have to believe in what you're actually having for them to do, offering them, whatever the case is. They need to believe in the opportunity you're sharing with them. They need to believe in the system or the method that you're sharing with them. And you just simply demonstrate this. You actually educate them on this. You can take the word marketing, which is what most people call it, you would say that this video is a marketing video. But I want you to instead, instead of calling it marketing, from now on, I want you to call it educating. You're actually educating people about how they can do it. You're educating them about how this thing works, what it does. And if you start focusing on just educating people in your posts and in what you're doing, you're gonna do so much better. It's what I'm doing to you right now. It's valuable, isn't it? So you gotta get them to believe in that. Then you gotta get them to believe that no matter what is outside of them, they can still make this happen. Because even if somebody says to themselves, oh yeah, I can do this stuff, and they believe in what you're offering them, if they don't believe they can do it because they've got two dogs, a job, three kids, and they gotta mow the yard and do all this stuff so they don't have time or they don't have the ability because of X, Y, and Z, they're not buying your stuff. They're not gonna get it because there's, this is a limiting belief that they have. These are all limiting beliefs that you gotta help them overcome. And right when they see your thing, they're like, I couldn't do that, or they could. And then they're like, well, that doesn't, that, that's not a good opportunity, that doesn't actually work, or they do believe it, 
or they're like, yeah, that's all good. I believe in the product. I believe that I can do it, but I just don't got time. I'm too busy, this, that, and the other thing. So until you get all three of these to unlock, nobody's buying anything. And that's what they're always asking. Can I do it? Is this good enough? What about all this other stuff? How am I going to make it happen? Now, the next thing that happens while you're simultaneously helping people overcome this, the next thing is you're going to have this customer journey that people have to go through. It, and, it, and it trims down. You see, it goes from a lot of people to a little bit less to just one. And this is just the way it is. And so about of all the people that you ever show your thing to, anywhere between 1% to 5% of people are going to actually buy. And it usually falls right in the middle here at like usually 2 to 3% of people. All the people out here, okay, that would be new people that have never heard of you, they don't know about your opportunity, nothing. But they do have the problem that you can solve. Okay, so for, in my example, let's say, because I help people turn their knowledge into income, I help people make money online. These types of posts that I'm doing is, did you know? It's always, did you know? Because they're sitting out there with a problem, and maybe for an, an easy example, they might be like, oh, my back hurts, but they don't know why. You know, it's like, God, it's like, I wish I could get this to go away. A post that I could do is, did you know that the reason your back might be hurting is because of these three things. And then I could talk about those three things. In everything that I'm doing, I'm doing a combination of, even in a did you know post, I'm saying, did you know that you can actually do this? Did you know that this product can do this? Did you know that even if these are your th situations, you can overcome it? So we're learning how to say one thing a thousand different ways. Like I've been talking about this stuff and this stuff and all of this stuff for over 10 years. I mean, how much? what, what else can you say after a while? Well, you just keep coming at it from different perspectives. ChatGPT can help you with this. Just Googling can help you. But I'm a student of my industry. I'm constantly studying this stuff. I'm constantly figuring out how this stuff actually works. I take these different perspectives and I make sure that I'm in alignment with what I have to unlock and knowing that people have to come through this. Because if I don't get people through this, they're not going to buy. It's just period. A lot of people just do content like this up here but they forget these stages, and that's why they'll say something like, well, I've been doing content. I do this stuff, but it's not working. Well, you got to unlock the other layers. Well, after somebody is you know, basically introduced to the idea of, oh my God, oh, I can do those things to make my back better? I didn't even know there was something like that. I wonder how to actually do this now. So your next style of posts are how-to posts. You know, how do you actually do this? So in this video, now that you realize that you can do some stuff to make your back better, let me show you, let me actually take you through and show you what you can do. Let me show you what this actually looks like, what's going on here, how to do this. So you can create a thousand different posts like that. There's going to be a certain percentage, like we said, one to five percent, that are going to want to do even more and they're going to want to have it happen faster and they want to have it easier and they just want to pay to get it done. So typically between here and here is when somebody becomes a lead. You might even get them to become a lead in between here, but nine times out of 10, it's usually in this area right here and they become a lead or in other words, they basically come over and they want to get the free guide. They want to go into your free community and go through the free classroom. They want to see the free training. They want to download the free blueprint. They want to know how this actually works. What is the, the guide to do it or the, the way to do it? Maybe they want your free pocket coaching stuff or whatever, right? They've basically came to the, the, you know, the understanding that, okay, there is something going on here. I see how this is working. Now I want to really get involved here. And then this right here is A versus B because once somebody already decides, okay, there's something out there now. I understand that I have a problem and there is a solution. And now I'm learning how the solution actually works. Let me take this deeper and do a little bit more research. And then when they finally do decide that they want to actually become a sale and they actually want to buy this thing, they're going to start comparing. They're going to be like, well, what, would I go with this place or this place? Like, how do I decide? So you're creating posts down here where it's like, you know, in most programs, you have to create your own product and then sell it. Well, with this program, the product's already created for you and you just have to learn how to educate people on how it works and share it with people. And then if they buy it, you make 100% profit. Or, you know, most programs, they won't take you through step by step. They'll just say, oh, you got to do this and oh, you got to do that. They won't meticulously break it down and show you what to do. That's what we actually do. And if you want even more help, 
then you can buy my thing or you can join this or you can download my thing. You've got to have this in place or they're not going to move. They're not going to do things. You got to take them from here to here to here. So that's why I always talk about, you know, doing three posts per day and these posts long, short, doesn't matter. You're wanting to do a post in each one of these areas and you just keep recycling. So the night before you're thinking, oh, okay, well, let me know what I'm doing so I can prepare because when you're prepared, you typically do better than if you're not. And it's just a simple, like I prepared this, look, I prepared it. I know what I'm gonna put in these blanks. I've got it here, it's interactive with you. It's engaging, right? I mean, let me know down in the comments if you like this style, I'll do more of this stuff, but let me know if you like it, it's different, you know? This is how you can be different. Just try different things like this. So the call to action. What most people do is the wrong thing. Every call to action they do, they're doing some sort of different call to action. So people get confused. You know, if you see me most of the time, I'm always wearing a black shirt. I always got my black make once hat on. I'm always doing that thing, right? And it's always a, the same message. Turn your knowledge into income. You know, create your own digital products, sell them online. You know, create a school, yada, yada, yada. It's the same thing. It's the same thing. I've got a free, I've got a free program. Go to makeones.com and get the free course. You know, go in there. It's, it's a completely free community. I've got a completely free pocket coaching. There's a hundred videos in there you can watch. Okay. You can learn this stuff. Some of you won't even need to buy anything from me. You can figure it out just with that. It's the same call to action every time. I see so many people out there. They've got all these different call to actions, all these different ideas, and it confuses your people. Every time you show up, you sound different, you look different, your captions are different, this is different, that's different. You know, the reason we watch Sunday night football is because it's on Sunday night, every night, every Sunday during football season, you know. The, the, the morning news is on at the same time, all the time, it kind of has the same pattern, same intro, same outro. We get used to it, we can trust it. People need to know you, they need to like you, and they need to trust you. And connection is currency. You need to connect with people. You need to share, why are you doing this? Okay, you need to share, why? Why are you doing it? How are you doing it? Okay, these are things people need to know. If you don't share why and how, how can I believe you? Focus on one call to action, and this call to action, it needs to be some sort of free gift. It needs to be some sort of free thing that people want that's actually in line. So maybe you have a, th a free blueprint that you're sharing with people. Maybe you've got a free guide that shows people how to get 10K in 30 days. Whatever it is, this free thing needs to always be talked about in your bio, in your content somewhere. We need to know where do we go get the rest of it. If you do this, people are confused. They're like, huh? Like, I don't know. Like, every day it's something different. Like, what the heck? You know? So get very consistent in the way that you are educating, not marketing. Marketing is actually just educating. Some people think marketing is going out there and, hey, you can, you know, oh, hey. And then they say, well, I don't know my message. I can't find my person. You're not looking for your person. Your person is looking for you. But you have to be attractive. You have to be attractive to them. You're not hunting. You're fishing. You find out what kind of fish are you trying to catch. Well, I'm trying to catch the fish that's looking to make money. Or I'm trying to catch the fish that's looking to get healthy or i'm trying to catch the fish that's looking to improve their their mindset or their relationships okay well you're trying to catch that fish. okay so let's find a lure that that fish would be attracted to trying to find your person you're not looking for their age you know where they live what they do all this stuff that's irrelevant because any kind of person big small left right brown blue purple green this that they all need health wealth and happiness <laughs> so you know this is known and so you're just, you know that. So what you're doing is you're creating content, like my content, the content unlock to always know what to say for growth. Well, who the heck would want that? What fish would want that? Well, probably a fish that's using content to get growth. Okay, so that would attract that person. But you have to be consistent. You have to be consistent with what you're saying, with when you're showing up, with how you're talking about things, with what you're doing. And you always wanna share your free thing. Let the free thing do the work. You're trying to educate people and tell them all this stuff and go through everything. That's why you create a free thing because it says the same thing every time, all the time. And that is a consistency that you need so that you can judge whether it's working or not. If you're sending to different things all the time, how can you optimize or know what is working or what is not? So the content format, I've been using this on you the whole time, all right? And 
I'm gonna tell you what it is right here so you never have to think about how do I do content. But before I show you this, make sure you go over to makeonce.com and click the red button. It's completely free and I'll show you how to turn your knowledge into income. Inside of my classroom in the free community, there's this thing called pocket coaching. It is an astronomical amount of free value that will blow your freaking mind. You won't even believe that it's free. Before we get into this, I need to share this with you just because it'll help you understand what's going on. We attract, convert, and deliver. That's it. Nothing more, nothing less. That is what we do. I don't care what you sell. I don't care who you are. I don't care what you're doing. We have to attract people. Then we have to convert them. Then we have to sell them and deliver the thing to them. Okay? How do we attract people? Well, you can pay for it with ads. You can do organic content or you can do partnerships. You can partner with somebody that already has a list and say, hey, if I share this with your list and somebody signs up or somebody buys, I'll give you whatever percentage. Organic, this is organic. I'm posting this, there's no ad money behind it, I'm just posting it. Paid ads, I could take this same video and I could say, hey, social media platform, put $20 behind this and show it to these types of people and it would push it out to those people. Nothing more, nothing less, this is it. Now you don't have to think anymore, it's just, paid organic partner. And at some point you would want to try to do all of these. Always, always the first two. Convert. You're either converting somebody into a lead or somebody into a sale. Delivery. You're either giving somebody a service. You're giving somebody a product. It can be physical or digital. It does not matter. Or you do my favorite one and what I do, which is a hybrid where you give somebody the service and the product. With my business, I give somebody, I have my Make Ones Pro community. It's a paid community. It's the price of a pair of shoes to be a member and you can cancel at any time, okay? But I show somebody step-by-step step how to turn their knowledge into a product, productize their knowledge, create an online program that they sell inside of a membership area and they make recurring income. Okay, so they get a product. They also get service because every single week I give them three calls a week and I make sure that I answer their questions I bring a new concept to them every month. I show them behind the scenes how I use it, and then I grab one of them and I help them implement it in their own business. I work with you until you get to success, and then I keep working with you if you want to. Okay, so it's a hybrid. You get service and a product. My product is digital. Attract, convert, deliver. You ever wonder, what do I do? Well, you need to be attracting. You need to be converting people that you're attracting into leads and sales, and then you need to deliver on your promise. The, what makes these things happen faster and go quicker is having an incredible product. If you wanna grow faster, create an incredible product. That's the whole thing. Your product is everything. It's what you do as a business. You don't become a business unless you have some sort of product. The product is the solution, solve problems. I'm helping you solve problems in a micro way. I'm solving just one little problem. Like what I'm sharing with you if you look at my whole program, let's say this is the whole program, and this is how you look at yours, that's why I'm sharing this with you, okay? You know, you may be down here, right? You don't know what to do, but you're trying to figure out what to do. This is B, this is A, you're trying to get from A to B. So I have a program that walks you through all those steps, just like you would have. All I'm doing with this is I'm just educating you, because I'm doing marketing, I just educate you about one of these little things. So inside of this module, let's say that there's three things. All I'm doing is I'm just taking one of these things and I'm just breaking it down for you. And then I go, hey, if you like this and you want even more help, then this is just a little piece of the piece of the pie. You need to know all these things to get what it is that you want. If you want more, go to makeones.com and I'll show you how to turn your knowledge into income. And if you want even more help, I have a paid community. It's the same call to action every time. There's no confusion. And if you just get consistent, you're gonna have great success. Now, I'm gonna go through this, then we're gonna finish up, okay? So when you go to do a piece of content, the first thing you're gonna share is the opportunity. The opportunity is, what are we talking about? What is the opportunity of this piece of content? It can basically be a combination of your, your main opportunity. Like my main opportunity is I show you how to turn knowledge into income. So all of my pieces of content, like this piece of content, what's the opportunity? I'm going to show you how to use con or how to create content to unlock what you need to say in your content for growth. So this is a little micro piece, but it's all for the big end game, which is this right here. Does that make sense? So this opportunity is how to create content. Know what to create so that you can create, ultimately, create money, okay? Or some people even call this 
the hook. Then, with every opportunity, just like in any story, you know, any story it goes like this. Oh, I want this thing. It's over here. So I'm here, but I want this thing. But as I was going along this way, I hit some struggle. What were those struggles? What were the challenges? The next thing with any, op uh, any piece of content is you're, ch you're sharing the challenge with it. I get it, trying to create content, I understand. You know, maybe you're scared of the camera, maybe you don't know what to say, maybe you think you need to have your face on it, all these things, I get that, okay? I was there too. Let me share with you what it was like for me so that we can get in the same boat with each other and we can connect and you can see if you and I are on the same page here. After you share your story, now they're like, okay, I can connect with this person. I, I'm having some of those same sorts of struggles in my own journey. The next thing, after they hear the opportunity, they hear the challenges, which make it real, and they start to hear your story, then they're like, well, okay, now what? Okay, get to the point, you know, now what? Well, then you share the steps. Try to keep these steps three to 10 steps. I wouldn't go over much more than that because it, you know, it just gets too much. Like here, I've got one, two, three, four, five steps. Okay, these are there's five steps here that I'm going over. Now you're just you're you're really laying in the education. What are we doing here? Like, how does this work? You know, is it a did you know how to A versus B? Those are the steps. After that, you need to buckle it down into some reality. So you have the myth, and then you have the reality. Okay, and this reality, I like to think of it in many cases like the data. You know, the numbers. Numbers don't lie. You know, a lot of people think that in order to create content and be awesome at content, you have to have all these tools, you have to be on the screen, you can't just be simple with it and just use like a piece of paper, you've got to have all this jazz, blah, blah, blah. The reality of it is, I've created many, picture, uh, many pictures like this on just paper without even showing my face, and people love the content. And they end up going over and becoming leads and buying my product. Let me show you. Show them some data, show them what it is. And then after you've done that, you've built a little trust there. You've showed some proof, like you've made some, some reality happen for them. You made it like real. Then what you wanna do is you recap. You basically say, so to create content and always know what to say, you wanna always realize that you're helping them believe in themselves, believe in your opportunity, your vehicle, your solution, and believe that no matter what's going on out there in the world, you can do this stuff. And instead of thinking about it as marketing and promotion, just think about it as educating. Be prepared, like I got prepared here, because you gotta get people to know, like, and trust you, and you've gotta let them know why you're doing something, how to do it, and like, what actually happened? You know, like, what got you into this? Help me. You've learned that you've got to always offer a free thing, and you want it to be the same free thing all the time, and you wanna just offer one thing so they don't get confused. You learned that there's three places that people have to travel through, three layers, before they can become a lead in a sale. Did you know how to A versus B? It's just the natural mental progression, and you're gonna convert anywhere from one to 5% of the leads that you generate. And then you also learned that there's only three things in attraction. You can pay for ads, you can do organic posts, or you can partner. And then you learned that after you attract people, you have to turn them into leads, and then the leads turn into sales. And then you learned that once you actually sell somebody, you have to deliver on your promise, and you can do that in a service, a product, or you can be the smartest about it and do it a hybrid way. This is the best. You would always want to serve your customers. So that's the recap. And then the call to action. It's the same call to action every time. And this is what you can do every time. Now, obviously, I would love if you subscribed. Okay, that'd be cool. Because then you can just get more of this and you don't have to think or find or whatever. It just comes to you. But aside from that, the biggest thing that I want you to do is go over and get my free pocket coaching. Go to makeonce.com and turn your knowledge into income. You're just taking your solution, you're gonna solve a problem, you're gonna use digital videos like this, you know, the thing that you're watching right now, and you're gonna learn how to turn it into an actual product. Now, this might not be for you. It very well may not be. I'm not saying it is, I don't know you. <laughs> I don't know how hard you work. I don't know if you even care about, you know, working a couple hours a day and making six or seven figures online. That may not be your thing. You may not be into it. I'm not saying it's for you, but you're not gonna know until you go check it out and it's completely free. You just go here, click the red button, join the community, introduce yourself so that you unlock the pocket coaching. It's very simple, and I know that you can do this. I just did this whole thing, and it was completely done faceless, right? Now, I did introduce some face into it, like I'm doing right here, but there's nothing that I just did that you can't do. Please share with me down in the comments 
maybe why you're not able to do this. Like you, why can you not do this? You can certainly do this. I would also like to know, was this content valuable to you? Did you like this style of content? I certainly did. I love doing this type of stuff or on the whiteboard and things like that. You can model and do what I do. You know, we brought in just about half a million dollars last month using videos like this, posting a few times a day, educating our audience, and then obviously serving them and, and giving them a great product. You can certainly do the same thing. I'll see you over in the next video, or you can watch the one that's probably on the screen already.